Hi, uh, my name is Tess and I'm going to show you how to make a, a joint for a jointed puppet using speaker wire. Um, so this is uh, speaker wire. You can get it at any hardware store and then you cut it open and inside is all these very, very fine filaments. So you take one and you cut off a chunk. And then you've got your two um, paper cutouts that you want to join together. This is kind of a torso and kind of an upper arm. And you create a hole through both of them at the same time. Okay, take the speaker wire if you can pick it up and thread it through both holes. Okay. And then you want to flip it over and hold down the back of it with your finger or a bit of tape to the cutting board. And then you've got this little bit that's sticking up. And what you do is you flatten it and then you twist it with your finger until it curls into itself. Okay, and you've got a nice little curl there. You can close it off a little bit more maybe if you want. Okay, so that's one side done. And then you flip it over on the other side cut off the excess and here you might have to hold down very close to the hole so you're pressing down on the curl underneath or you might want to add a little tape to that so that the curl doesn't move as you do the other side. Keep twisting. And there you go. So now this is a join and um, it works very well. There's no memory, so the limb doesn't spring back. And it's very flat, not completely flat, of course, but very flat because the wire is very thin. So it's not bumpy at all. Now, of course, it's not invisible. You can see it. Um, but I think it works pretty well. There you go.